In this uh, video, I want to look at the unary operators. That's in op opposite to the binary operators. Binary means the plus minus multiplication where you have an operand on both sides. Unary means it's an operator that has only one operand. Okay, so you'll see in this example we've got uh, integer a which is 7 and integer b which is 12. Now we have the command a plus plus. Notice the unary operator is plus plus and it only works on the a. It simply means you add 1 to a. And the b minus minus you subtract 1 from b. So in this example the a goes from a 7 to an 8 and the b goes from a 12 to an 11. But there's a complication that we need to uh, be aware of when we start using the unary operators in assignment statements. In this example you'll see it says answer is assigned to A++. Now the way C-sharp does this is as follows. Because the plus plus is after the variable A, it first assigns the 7, the current value of A, to answer. So after this expression, answer will have the value 7. After doing the assignment statement, it increases A to 8. So after this statement, answer will have the value 7 and A will have the value 8. Now in this example, it's plus plus A in the expression. So we have answer is assigned to plus plus A. Because the unary operator is before the variable, it first increases the value of A to 8 and it then assigns 8 to answer. So after this expression, answer will have the value 8 as well as A, which will also be 8. The same applies to the minus minus. In this example, B has the value 12, and then we say answer is assigned to B minus minus. Because the minus minus is after the variable, the assignment happens first, so answer takes on the value 12. After that, b is decreased by 1 to, to become 11. So at, after this expression, answer has the value 12 and b has the value 11. Now we've swapped it around and it says answer is assigned to minus minus b. Because the minus minus is before the b, the first thing that is done is the minus minus is, is applied to B, so B becomes 11. And then the 11 is assigned to answer. So after this expression, answer will have the value 11 as well as B, which will also be 11.